So assume we have a variable like this. Now this particular variable, I wanted to, uh, you know, so I mean, the basically like the for the KV for for loop, which you asked by the way. So here the for loop is um, for loop uh, on outputs. Now I want the data in such a way that outputs I'm taking because I just want to print it, right? That's it. You can also use it anywhere. That's okay. And now this, let's go to the Terraform official documentation. Mm -hmm. For loop Terraform. There's nowhere official document coming in the starting line. Okay. So Terraform loops. Okay, for expressions. So this is the documentation. <clears throat> so this is the one I think, so we are using. So output, maybe the same next budget, the value is equal to like this. And for the discussion, which you asked, is expression. So this is the one you asked. Now for K in, okay. Now try to understand. So if you remember that, you know, so our uh, Ansible basics and all also, we talked about it, right? So what we talked about, so, I mean, when you have some data, by the way, so you'll be having key is equal to value, right? And yes. key is equal to multiple values, which is going to be a list, right? So value one, value two, like that. And also you have a key, again, having a key values, okay? So this you are clear, right? Yes, 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 sir. Okay, now, now this is called as a map. Okay. Now in this map, this is called as a key and this whole thing is a value. This part also you're clear, right? So that means if I keep it in one line, uh, this can happen like this. Okay. Now key is equal to this whole thing is a value. Yes. Now what is the for loop is telling for key and value? This is the K this is the key. This is the value. Now in our case, if I just go to the XYZ, now app one is a key and this whole thing is a value. Yes. Right. Now what I'm telling is, hey, give me the output, which is a map output. Now you print me key is equal to something. So that means key is equal to what? App one. So that becomes like app one. But the value of this map is coming as a map only. So it starts with a map. Okay. So it's starting with a map. So now the key is equal to app one. But however, the value inside that is V dot public IP. Okay, in our case, this is the whole value V, V dot name. That means let's say if I want a cart value, the value of this one, okay, to be printed. So that means what I would be giving? V dot name. Name. So that means this, ideally the output it is going to be expected to print is like this, app2 is equal to catalog. Oh. Okay, yes. if yeah. I have an output like this. So that means if I just go back, and uh, so if I run this, so what it is to instance.web, no, sorry. This is var.xyz because we are dealing from the variable. The data can be source, can be anyone. So not, you see this, this is the thing. Now we just manipulate the, the data in a way that we want it. That's it. Nothing more than that. That's for loop is doing this just that. Okay. Thanks. Ram. 